the mystery of the overheating Fluval 13 and a half gallon has been solved. And if you like aquarium content, go ahead and subscribe. No heater, no lid has got this tank down to uh, just over 76 degrees. It settles in right around there. So if you've been following along at home, you'll know that I was having an overheating issue with this aquarium. The temperature was going up to nearly 83 degrees and I'm shooting for a temperature around 77, 78 degrees. I've had the heater unplugged basically all week. And uh, uh, yesterday I decided after some comments from you all to just take the lid off and allow for some evaporation and I'll let the heat out and all that stuff. And that seems to have definitely made a difference for sure. What am I going to do long term? Because not running the lid on here uh, as it sits is not going to work because the lid is at, or the light is actually inserted in the lid. So as it stands right now, to have a light, I need to add a light. And there are a lot of options where I'd maybe I'd attach the arm over here and then it would hang over the top. I picked this because I wanted it to work as is. And if it's not going to work as is, then why is Fluval even selling this kit if it's just gonna overheat? So I'm wondering if I go ahead and put the, the lid on now, now that the, uh, the water temperature is back to normal, I'm just gonna put the lid on without the heater and just see what happens and see if it kind of holds this temperature or if the temperature goes down between now and in the morning. Um, if the temperature decides to go back up, then I think we'll have a different discussion because I'm also wondering if the mo the, uh, the the return pump is actually heating the water up as well. Either way, this tank should work as it comes out of the box. That's kind of the whole point. If it doesn't work with the lid, then I, it, I might as well have gotten something else, right? We've got the lid back on and now it is all lit up. Um, we did have a little bit of uh, what looked like diatom growth potentially that was building up on the sand uh, a day or two without any kind of lights to really knock that out. So that'll probably come back with a vengeance if I were to leave the light on. But I'm not even going to turn the light on because I know that the light puts some heat off. I just want to just put the lid back on and just see what happens. So let's just turn that guy off. We'll see what happens and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Reckless reefing.